Right, one, six, seven kVA generator. Problem is, it's been, uh, it suffered a bit. Uh, I've replaced a lot of melted connectors, replaced broken connectors, and I've added a connector which made it easier to uh, install. I've kept the colours the same, with the exception on here, where the wires in and out of the plug were different, so I've now made them the same to the circuit board. So I've got, uh, yeah, there's three wires to this little circuit board here. This is the oil protection. So the oil level goes low, it will then turn off. The red wire I found is a starter, starter wire. The white wire appears to be a positive. The green wire, I think, is uh, for uh, powering things up. It's hard, it's hard to tell really what's going on here. Uh, I've got a mystery wire, I've got a black wire here. That I don't know what it does. And I've got a yellow wire. And I'm not even sure what it does. I suspect it may be a, a sense wire or something. Yes, again, these were part of the ignition switch. So they probably go onto here somewhere, but I don't know where. Uh, and I'm going to put a new LED in there uh, because this one's uh, suffered a bit. And I've rewired all the, the mains set plugs along here, which is easy enough to do. Uh, yeah, tricky one, really. So I have this lovely generator, which does start. Uh, the previous user had it started for me, but uh, yeah, new switch in there, voltmeter, 32 amp, uh, 240 volt, and 232 amp, uh, 110 or 115. Nice breaker there, the 12 outlet. That's all been, you know, all, everything all there works, the voltmeter works. The switch there, I believe, all what, does what it's supposed to do. Uh, so, uh, yeah, what needs to do work now is actually work out how that's been wired, which is, uh, yeah, tricky, to say the least. Anywho, I've also put an Anderson plug onto the battery leads, so if I have an external battery, I can just plug it straight in. Makes life a lot easier. So, yeah, slowly working on that. It's a little bit of a uh, brick of a machine. Uh, pretty damn heavy. Uh, I would love a wiring diagram, so if anybody knows what it might be, you can get me a wiring diagram. That'll be very handy. Because at the moment, I'm a little bit stuck. Over this side, the regulator here was blown up. That had melted. Uh, I've put a new one in as best as I can work out. I just need to make these uh, connections there, and I'm satisfied that I'm not going to go and blow it up. It's very confusing. Uh, and this is the regulator here that controls something to do with the mains output. It's an alternator, which is this big brick here. So yeah, coming together slowly, frustratingly slowly. Uh, love a wiring diagram. Uh, yeah, just job to know. Job to know where to begin when you've got a uh, <laughs> pig's ear of wires. Oh, take care. Have fun. Another instalment later.